guys welcome back to my channel I know I'm looking a little cray right now I have this thing in my hair I just did a tutorial on this makeup using the Lorac Queen palette from the Royal Collection so if you want to see how I created this look um, I will link the tutorial in the down bar for in the down blur in the down bar for you to check out but today's video is going to be a first impression on the L'Oreal voluminous Miss Manga Rock and I've had this bad boy for quite some time, but I've been holding out because I've got quite a few mascaras that are already opened and I didn't, you know, you know, you know. Anywho, I did a first impression on the original, which comes with the pink metallic um, top. So if you want to see that video, that review and demo, I will link it down below so you can check it out. If you want to pause this video check that one out first so you can kind of compare but anyway um so yeah this says that it's um spiked overloaded volume it's got a 360 degree spiked brush it says explosive volume and rebellious spikes it says uh the look spiked overloaded volume on top and bottom for lashes with a rebe rebellious rock attitude the brush 360 degree spike brush loads maximum volume from the roots and stretches lashes to the pointed tips. The formula. Mega texturizing formula creates a high intensity impact. The tip. Hold brush vertically and use pointed tip on the end of brush to create ultra soft points for a more extreme rock look. So I'm going to go ahead and open this up and zoom on in. So if you want to see how this works, then just stay tuned. Okay, now we're up close and personal. So sorry if you can see my wrinkles and all that kind of stuff, but hey, it happens. Okay, you're all going to get them. So just you wait. All right, so I have my handy dandy little mirror here and I'm going to go ahead and open this up. So the packaging looks like this. Um, I wish I had the other one to show you and kind of compare the two, but I've already thrown it away. Um, the brush does not swivel like the last one did. Um, I don't know if you could see all the little spikes. It has rows and rows and rows of spikes and it's tapered so it's kind of like a cone shape um, if you can see that there so I'm gonna apply it to my bottom lashes first and then we'll go on to the top all right well actually I'm gonna do one eye at a time so if I can keep you guys in frame I'm gonna do one layer first or one coat, I should say. So right off the bat, I really like it. Um, I don't know if you guys can see that, but I like it. It gave me lots of volume and definitely gave me length. So I'm gonna let this dry. I'm gonna curl my top lashes and then we'll do the top lashes and then we'll go back and apply a second coat okay so I'm gonna curl my lashes so I'm gonna apply some to the top lashes and let's see so as you can see the before let's see how dramatic we can get this lash so I'm just kind of wiggling it and then pulling it up and I don't know y'all so far I really like it it's kind of clumpy in a good way if that makes any sense and I don't even know if if you guys can see what I'm doing so that is one coat I think it's pretty good Pretty good stuff. I don't know if you can. Uh, uh I got some on my eyelid. All right, so I'm gonna go in with a second coat on the bottom. I'm not gonna re-dip the brush. I'm just gonna use what's left on from the upper lash line or upper lashes. So 
So, yeah, I think that's what I'll do is just do a tutorial with this. Um, the next tutorial I do, I will use this mascara so you can really see. So that is that on the bottom lashes. And as you can tell, it has definitely given me some um, length. I have very, very small eyelashes so I'm impressed y'all I'm impressed so going in for a second coat and this is definitely a clumpy edgy rocker type of mascara it's very thick as in how it looks the texture is not that thick but when it applies it's very thick. Well, it makes your lash lashes look very thick. All right, so that is that for the top. I don't know. Oh, shit. Eh, I smudgered it. All right, let me fix that. Let me take some of this off. Dang it, Beavis. Why you do that? Okay. Let's try that again. So as you can see um, on my lashes, it definitely gave me some volume, definitely gave me some length, thickness, everything. I love it. I love it, love it, love it. So what I'm going to do is it's very wet, as you can tell. So yeah, the formula is very wet. It's getting all over the place. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do the other eye off camera, and then I'll be right back and give you my final thoughts on this mascara. This is what both eyes look like up close and personal and as you can tell I like it because it's definitely definitely lengthening and volumizing and I need that in my life. So yeah, I'm giving this mascara a thumbs up. So yeah, don't forget if you want to see the makeup tutorial using the uh, Queen palette from the Lorac Royal Collection, click the link below. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this review, first impression, demo. And yeah, don't forget to subscribe for more videos and I'll see you next time. Bye guys. Mwah.